hello everyone welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi my name is Jakara and today I'm going to be doing a pet portrait for a family who recently lost their little puppy and um, she went over the rainbow bridge and I was commissioned to do this portrait for the family and I've already you know started on it so let's get started so this is Lola. This is the little doggy that recently passed and her family was so distraught. I guess they'd had her for over 15, 16 years. I think she was close to 20 years old. So I've gotten most of the like important fur kind of details. I'm going to start working on the nose and the eye. I did do some nose contouring and working on that a little bit, but um, the eyes are next. So I'm going to do the eyes and then if I need to, I'll come back to the nose and then we'll finish up with the fur although you know i don't know much more about what i could do for the fur um uh, again i'm a beginner painter so i'm just learning and uh, hopefully we'll get it to a point where i'm at least happy with it <laughs> right now it's about 80 percent of the way there uh, maybe 85 percent uh so let's get that extra 15 percent with the way the eyes look. It took a few days to get that right. Well, I, not consistently three days, I, you know, an hour or two at a time. 
I'm not too happy with the nose. I think the nose needs some tweaking. And then I think the fur down here just needs to be softened up a little bit. It's a little too many like big brush strokes. So I'm gonna try and make smaller brush strokes and make it a little softer. And I might work on the muzzle a little bit more too. But I think I'm about 90% there. So let me get back to it. the corner of her shoulder there it was too square so I rounded it off a little bit so I'm gonna go add some uh, hairs some fur in this area I fixed the neck a little bit so I think she's looking way better way better I think I'm about 95% 9 to 98% there all right she's finished all done I've already shown her to the person who commissioned her and I think she looks pretty good I mean if I had to go back and do it again I would make her face a little smaller and her chin a little smaller as well but <clears throat> here's some details some close-up details I love the eyes and the nose I also love the texture of the fur and the layers of the fur, like there's some gray and there's some light brown and then um, the white fluffy fur on top. Um, so I did struggle a little bit with her nose and her eyes. I was trying to get the right coloring. Um, I had painted a portrait of my dog Pepino, which is a Yorkie. And so his coloring is a little different. So when I went to do the nose, I was a little confused about the coloring because uh, Lola here, her nose is black and gr like the, with gray highlights, whereas my dog's nose is like a brownish blackish color. So that was a little hard. Um, and then also the eyes, her eyes are round, whereas my dog's eyes are more, I mean, I guess they are round, but they look more almond shaped, I guess, in the picture that I use as a reference. So that was a little different as well. Um, but overall, um, the chin is also a little different. Yeah, it was a challenge, but it was fun to do. And I'm so happy that the family is going to get this as a way to help honor their littlest family member. All right, you guys, that is it. That is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope I see you in the next video. Until I see you next time. Take care.